Guts, also known as the Black Swordsman, is a great example of how to subvert people's expectations. When we first meet Guts, he can best be described as an edgy anti-hero fixated on revenge. He has one eye and a huge chunk of metal on his back that can cut a man in two with one slice. He has a cynical outlook on life, is wary of strangers, and says he doesn't care what happens to the world as long as he gets his revenge against his enemy, Griffith. Guts was one of the first ever edgelord characters in fiction, and basically single-handedly popularized this type of character. But unlike all the other edgelords that have come since his inception, Guts actually changes. Guts' character gets developed to the point that everything I said about him before doesn't apply anymore. Later in the series, Guts devotes himself to a heroic goal. He encourages and supports the people around him, and refuses to sacrifice innocence for the sake of revenge. He is still traumatized by his past, but he actively tries to change. In the end, Guts cannot be explained by anyone. He has so many sides and characteristics that the only way to truly understand him is to read Berserk. So that's why I think 